This video is going to be slightly different, namely because we're going to be playing a quick game where I ask you three questions and you will of course give me an answer. Now of course I can't actually hear you but you can actually tally it for yourself. So grab a piece of paper, get a pen or maybe do this mentally. The first question will be very easy. On screen I have a picture of Subaru. I want you to tell me what is Subaru's canon eye colour? I'll give you a few seconds, it should be really easy, you got an image to help you. Anyways, let's move on. For the second question, I've got a picture of Melee on screen. Now this may be tricky, so make sure you listen to exactly what I ask for. What is Melee's hair colour in Arc 2 when she's in Arlen Village? On screen you have an image of Melee. Okay, moving on. For the final question, again this is going to be the hardest question here. This is Cattleman's Child. What is her hair colour? Okay, there we go. Those are the three questions and let's go through the answers and tell me how many you got. So on screen, I now have the three images that we were talking about. So for the first result, I take it most of you got the colour brown for Subaru's eye colour. For Melee, most of you guessed that her hair colour is purple. And the final question, which is the hardest one, is of course Cattleman's Child and her hair colour is of course green. If you got these answers then you have got 0% correct. For those wondering what the actual correct answers are you can see them on screen. Subaru has black coloured eyes. Melee has brown hair in Arc 2 when she's in Arlen Village and Cadillan's child actually has brown hair. Now of course most of you would not know this if you haven't read the light novels because the anime took some creative liberties for some odd reason. Either way let me know if you caught the trick that I did this episode. I want to see how many of you actually knew the canon answers for these questions. Anyways I'm sure some of you are immediately clicking away going to the wikia to check what the wikia says and you can see the wikia states that Subaru has brown coloured eyes. Again, in the anime we do actually see that, however that isn't actually the case and the wikia is in fact wrong. At the very least it fails to differentiate Subaru's eye colour from what is actually in the light novel. On screen I'm going to show you a few excerpts from the light novel to actually confirm that Subaru does in fact have black coloured eyes. The first one is when Subaru is in the Forbidden Library and Beatrice compares Subaru to a cockroach and describes him as a cockroach with black eyes. When Subaru first meets Beetlejuice, the narration states that Subaru's black eyes blink. During Rem and Subaru's speech, I believe in Season 1 Episode 18, again Rem looks into Subaru's black eyes. And again later on, when Subaru and Julius talk to each other, again you can see that Julius's yellow eyes are of course reflected in Subaru's black eyes and vice versa. Now this is actually really important, at least for the story of ReZero, because again having black eyes and a black hair colour is very important, especially for Subaru's character. Either way, if you're anime only, take this as trivia that you did not know. In fact, if anyone here makes a Subaru fact video, I feel like one of the facts should always be that Subaru has black coloured eyes, because that will definitely catch most people off guard. Either way, that's it for the anime onlys. Now if you're a web novel reader, I'm going to move on, so if you're anime only, I highly recommend you click off the video now. Now, I think most of you know why I'm making this video, mainly due to Volume 29's illustration showing Aldebaran and Subaru when they're shrunken down. Of course, a lot of people have really noticed that Aldebaran looks exactly like Subaru, even down to the fact that they have small irises. By the way, I know some of you are thinking, oh, what do you mean small irises? What I mean is this. In Volume 1 of the light novel of ReZero, Subaru's small irises is actually a characteristic of him alone and this is how it's used to describe him. So it's really ironic when you see Aldebaran have the exact same facial features as Subaru. And I don't know how this video became Subaru's true eye colour and somehow turned into Subaru equals Owl theory, but just bear with me for a moment. The main reason why I'm making this is because some people will say, well Al and Subaru cannot be the same person because they have different coloured eyes. And this video is to show you, no, they have the exact same eye colour, they have the exact same 
hair color, they have the exact same iris shape of their eyes, which is really small. Now, will this change actually have some form of influence when the anime catches up to arc seven in like 12 years? And I actually do believe so, because if you remember in chapter 54, Abel wants Subaru to remain a kid. And it's implied that he cannot use medium because she has a different hair and eye color, and he cannot use Aldebaran because he's missing an arm. And that's of course because Subaru has black eyes and black hair, and Vincent also has black eyes and black hair. So it seems like he might use Subaru as a like body double, and he wants Subaru to remain as a kid. Now of course this is actually pretty weird because in the anime as stated before, Subaru has brown eyes, which is again going to be really weird to explain when ReZero gets up to arc 7, if it ever does, 